you introduce yourself uh, my name is amita shri kumar currently i'm working as a manual tester here in bochusa um and yeah that that's it okay so explain inheritance and types of inheritance so inheritance means uh, in inheriting properties from one class to other class so there are different type of inheritance like single level multi level multiple level um, hierarchical hybrid inheritance so single level inheritance means uh, one uh, subclass will inherit a properties from its mm, super class multi level means one subclass will uh, inherit properties from its mm, super class and this super class will inherit properties from its parent class and we have multiple level inheritance level in inheritance one single class uh, can uh, inherit properties from multiple parent class but in this case we will have a diamond problem uh, so that uh, in java uh, using class it is not possible multiple level inheritance is not possible so, so that we will use in, uh, interface uh, and then we have a uh, uh, hierarchical uh, inheritance so in a hierarchical in inheritance uh, we uh, multiple uh, subclass can inherit from a single parent class and then we have hybrid hybrid means it is a combination of single multi and a hierarchical inheritance okay what is a super calling statement super calling statement mm -hmm. okay um so whenever we are inheriting uh, uh, so in case of inheritance when a uh, class when a child so a subclass inherit properties from its parent class it will only inherit properties like methods and variables but uh, co constructors cannot be inherited in that case we can use super calling uh, method to call a um, parent class constructor Uh, on a um, child class constructor that's why we are using super calling statement the what is difference between local and global variable so local and global variable so local variables are variables which are declared within a method and the scope of that method will be within that particular method i mean scope of that variable will be within that particular method but global variables are variables which will be declared out outside of a method but inside of a class and the scope will be from the start to end of that class so we can say uh, the global variable um we can uh, so the uh, local variable can only be used within the method and uh, global variable can be used uh, within that class entire class okay what is the uh, use of scanner scanner class is a default uh, class which is provided in java uh, so that we can get input from uh, the user so if you have to get input from the user we can use scanner class okay what all methods we have in scanner uh methods okay in scanner class we have different methods like dot next in dot next dot next double uh like that we can if we want to take a uh, int value then we can use dot next in if we have to get the string value then it's like dot next like that we have a lot of methods okay okay write a string program to check if uh, two strings are anagram like uh, like uh, num what string number name is uh, triangle string number b is integral okay let me share my screen hmm. let me close everything yeah Mm-hmm. 
Create a class here. Class. So can can I two can I take two string? I mean, can I take two strings by myself, or I do you want to give me a value? Okay, I'm another okay. Giving back string one is a uh, Sangeet, string, string two is Tignas. Check if two strings are anagram to each other. Or... Okay, string one is Sangeet, S A N G E E T. Okay, and string B is uh, T E E G N A S. T E E G N A S. Okay. So I have to check whether this is anagram or not. Okay. So first, what I will do? Um, first I'll check the length. Mm -hmm. Okay. Four. Um. Okay. No. If a dot length. is equal to b dot length then okay I'll not equal to this. not length not an anagram. Else, we go to else block, and here hmm, uh, A is equal to Sangeet. So let me convert this to. Uh, and uh, one is equal to um, equal to a dot two character array then a one dot so I raise not the one. Let me print this first. This out. Yeah, B one equal to B dot and And this dot sort B one. Now I'm checking if 
dot equals a one and b one if it is equals then it will be an anchor R and they are an I'm sorry. Yeah, they, those are an Okay, write another program to sort array in ascending order. Take uh, array names as 40, 50, 70, 80, and 90, and sort them in ascending order. Okay. So I have an array, right? Yes, array. So array is 10, 20, 30, 40, 70, 80. 10, 20, 30, 30 40, 70, 80. So I should arrange it in descending order? Yes, sir, descending order. Is it going to or I don't mean it?
Uh, I'm not able to recall. Can you give me a clue how, how to do this? I can hint. First, uh, you need to sort it. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Dot reverse. Mm. That is dot sort yeah. array. And then first we have to sort it and then we have to reverse it. Mm -hmm. Array is dot reverse. Really, that sort you took of a byte. I saw that it was written in bracket byte. So, can you take again sort that sort? Dot sort. sort. It's one, two, three, four, fifth line. It is in. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Array dot the string. Here is dot string. Okay, it is sorted. Sorted now we have to reverse it. Dot reverse. The voice is not there. Then arrays dot sort in bracket ARR, comma collections dot reverse order. Yeah, collections, that's what I was thinking. Collections dot. 
we first array is dot sort then in bracket in bracket means uh, yes in bracket uh, that arr comma then called collections dot reverse order not here in line 12 collections dot reverse order so Collection start reverse. So it is not applicable for argument in it. Reverse. Mm -hmm. When I try so, so yes, in string yeah. also put to in double quote you do string array equal to that 10, 20, 30, 40, yeah, 30, yeah. 80 double quotes array equal to. Oh, that is uh, that cur curly braces is there. The close curly braces should be close square braces in line nine. I have to change this to this. No, no, no. Both square no, no. braces. Yeah. Uh, yeah, square braces. Okay. And within the curly braces. Mm -hmm. I will give string 10, string 11, I mean 20, string 30, string 40, string 70, 80. 
Okay. Now, if I try it was the ones. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. It's like okay, Amita. Thank you. Theoretically, thank you me. are very good, and the stream programs also you have done brilliantly. Array programs you need to bit do a bit more practice. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Thank you, Ishan. Okay, thank you.